Hey, David here, and let's talk about infinite loops and the break statement. Very similar to Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers. Or not similar at all. Anyways, uh, don't judge my music. So basically what we're going to talk about is what happens if you have a while, and inside of here you just hard code in true. So this loop is always going to repeat, because this statement right here is always true. Always. Um, true. So how you break out of this is using the break statement. So you would just, like let's say after you run through this once and you have your code right here and you want to immediately break, you could just call break. And this line right here will take you directly outside of your loop and you can proceed business as normal. But that doesn't make much sense. The best way to use a break statement is inside of an if then statement. Uh, so like if you have if and then some condition such as are we there yet and then you could just have break so once this con condition is met you will break simple enough so once you reach here you'll come out here and like let's say you're you're in a while loop inside of a while loop so we then surround this guy in its own infinite loop. Well, essentially, this break will only break us right here, and then we will continue to go in the giant infinite loop, um, the one surrounding it. If you wanted to create a break that um, exited the entire loop, all loops, you would need a named break statement. And notice the name of the video, unnamed. So that will not be covered in this video. Thank you very much. So in the next uh, video, I'll show you how to actually code this, hopefully with a slightly humorous example. I don't know.